What's up, nerd family? Welcome once again to the Poindexter Lounge. My name is Enosh, aka Enosh Fett, coming to you from beautiful Kansas City. That's right, there's the Kansas City Conference Center right there. And today, I wanna to talk to you about something because it was just announced yesterday that they actually are looking to start filming of the Masters of the Universe movie. And I'm gonna ask a guy on the street right here who's a random person who doesn't know who I am at, at I all down here. All. Hey, uh, John. Yes. I mean, I mean, excuse me, sir, what's your name? Uh, John. Oh, hey, John. How are you? Good. Now, now you're a nerd like me, so this is perfect, right? Yeah. Because uh, uh, this, this is the Poindexter Lounge uh, uh, family right here. Yes. And so um, I, it was just announced that they're actually moving forward on a Masters of the Universe movie. Keep saying the same people over and over again. Now, this has been in development, out of development. So I want to ask an average person on the street who I do not know and would, and would not have any kind of influence on it all, do you think it will actually happen this time? I don't. I, it, I would like it to, but I don't think it will because it, this is something they tried and they made an okay movie the first time they did it years ago. But I don't know. It, it they would. It would take a lot of money and a lot of effort, and that's why I think it's not going to happen again. This yeah, time. It's it's been it's been rumored, it's been talked about, it's been in production, out of production. John Woo actually was working on one for a while, and that totally fell apart. And uh, but now they're saying they're actually going to start filming this year. Yeah, but who's going to be He Man? That's I don't know. Thing. Who do you? That's the thing. Who plays He Man? Because it. You know, I mean, Lundgren was okay. Yeah. Schwarzenegger would have been decent back in the day, but yeah. there's there's no bulky big action star out there right now that could do it unless i mean you could you could go the direction of like a rock or somebody maybe but that completely uh, goes away from the source material. see so here's here's my fear here's my fear john cena oh eh. because well and here's why my fear is john cena because all of a sudden he's popping up in all these movies right yeah. he's making this hollywood push he's got the body for it I don't know if he's got the chops. I just don't think he has the chops. I, I mean, he's got the look. You put that mop top haircut on yeah. him, and and he actually could pull off the look for sure. Maybe if you replaced yeah. his voice. <laughs> yeah, have somebody dub it. You know, so, the, somebody dub his go. voice. That would be perfect. And I'd love to see him in some pink and purple for uh, Prince Adam. <laughs> that would be awesome. But, but you know, hey, who knows if it'll happen or not. We'll have to wait till the end of the year and see if we actually get some casting. I know the Rock thing, you know, it's like the Rock has the perfect body for it. You know it's going to end up probably being some wrestler or something. That's it the problem. Be, it could get as far as like when they started to do Superman Lives and they're, yeah. you know, they're they're doing all these screening, you know, these these test shots and Nick Cage is actually wearing this, the outfit. It could get that far and then just fall apart because people yeah. might, it, it just might not be a good idea. It's just, I think it's a hard property to do live action. I think that's the problem. It is. That's the problem. It almost has to be animated. I know. It, it, it's just because it, it's just, it might not live well in the real world. Because like you said, the original Masters of the Universe, the problem with that one was that it didn't follow as closely. Yeah. You know? And so it was very vague. They brought it to Earth. It just ended up being a weird kind of movie. And they, yeah. they actually spent the budget on Superman 4 on that movie. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's why we got cool lasers in the He-Man movie and Superman looked like a cardboard cutout flying towards the screen. Exactly. So, well, thank you, Mr. Man on the Street. You're I appreciate welcome. your honest and totally uh, off-the-cuff opinion. Yeah, you're welcome, Enosh, who I've never met before. Yes, totally just ran into him down here in Kansas City. All right, well, until next time, my name is Enosh, uh, a.k.a. Enosh Fett, but I want to know what do you guys think out there? What do you think of this He-Man movie? Do you think it'll actually happen, or do you think that, like, there's just no way it's going to actually happen and that um, it'll just fall apart like the other ones have? Um, also, who would you like to see cast in the role of He-Man? Or do you, do you think that somebody like John Cena could pull it off, or do you have somebody else in mind? Let me know down in the comment section. All right, guys, until next time, um, hey, by the power of Grayskull, I have the power, and I'm going to walk to lunch now. See you later. Bye-bye.